Before we talk about using services in Java models, let's talk a little about the concept of using services in general. Services are a way to provide specific functionality that can be used by other parts of an application or even by other applications. The main idea behind services is to decouple the service consumer that is the part of the application that uses the service from the service provider, the part that implements the service. This decoupling allows for greater flexibility, easier maintenance, and the ability to swap or add new implementations without changing the code that uses the service. So in Java, a service is defined by an interface which outlines functionality provided by the service. Service providers implement this interface, while service consumers use instances of the interface without needing to know which specific implementation they are using. Java services in Java models take advantage of the service loader mechanism. So service loader is actually a built-in Java utility that can discover and load service implementations at a runtime. It searches for implementations of a given service interface in the model parts and makes them available for service consumers. To iterate and summarize, in the context of Java models, a service is an interface or abstract class that defines a contract, a set of methods, for other classes to implement. A service provider is a model that provides an implementation for that service. A service consumer is a model that uses the service implementation through the service contract. Now, all this jargon, in case you are confused and uh, used and misused. I'm just kidding. With an example, it will all become clearer. But just focus on these five steps. And I'll demonstrate that. To define and use services in Java models, one, we define a service interface or abstract class. We implement the service interface in a service provider model. We declare the service and its providers in the model info of the service provider model. We consume the service in another model and declare service dependency in the model info of the service consumer model. We will go through this step by step and as we're going through it, it all begin to click 